Hey, y'all, if you're looking for a little bit more country, but not a lot more country, might have the good solution for you today. Yeah, we're in Ridgeville, but it's like barely Just Ridgeville. barely. Like, I'm in Ridgeville now. Now I'm in Somerville. Right. Now I'm back in Ridgeville. Now I'm in... This is... It's like a two-step, right? Yeah, right. It's I never like, thought I'd get you dancing the, on video. This is the Ridgeville Somerville dance right here. <laughs> hey, if we haven't met, I'm Jeff Craig, Mark Lim with Charleston Area Living. Do real estate all over the Charleston market and out into Ridgeville. Somerville's been growing so much that I think this is the next progression of where uh, we're going to be heading. And Absolutely. It's, it's out here just a mile and a half past Summer's Corner. Yeah, so pretty close to the intersection of Highway 17 and Highway 61. Um, so if you want to get to the Summer's Corner area, yeah. Legend Oaks Golf Course right. is really close. And we're Grosh probably only 10 minutes from Dorchester Road here. And yes. then you've got all the stuff down Dorchester, 15 all the Walmarts and grocery stores. To grocery and stores and all, that, and all that. Absolutely. And right down the road, we're five, I think five miles away from Givens uh, State, State Park. Park. Yeah, 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 yeah. Really cool park. So this place is called Parker's Preserve. It says it right there. It says it on there? Yep. So I got it right? You okay, did. good. Yep. Good job. So they've got lots here that, uh, a lot of lots that back up to woods, uh -huh. some lots that back up to ponds, Yeah. a few lots that back up to other houses, but otherwise there's, I think about 55 lots. Of, and there's seven different models. Seven different here. floor plans. So we're gonna show you today one, uh, one of the bigger ones they have up, up over 3,000 square feet. Yep. They've got master down, master up, uh, Three bedroom up to five bedroom, I think. Yep. Uh, and it, it's uh, there's some there's some cool plans here. I, I live in an Eastwood home and I, I really have been happy with it. Yeah, it's been a pretty good build for you. It you has. Said. Yep, I yeah. enjoyed the experience. All right, well let's go check these out then. Let's do it. All right, this one's the Raleigh, 2251 square feet, three beds, two baths. I like it. It kind of looks like a one story, but it's not. It's a sneaky one. It's story. a sneaky, yeah. Now if you're really good, you get pine straw on your porch. <laughs> yes, that's. That's, that's extra that, though. That, that for our clients, it's included. Yes, yes. I like the stone on the front. And then you've got the, uh, I think this is laminate. Yeah, this is definitely laminate. So there's your flex space, your formal dining room, whatever you want to make it. Still got the crown in here. You've got the uh, chairs and squares or the wainscoting. We've got sparkly. Sparkly with uh, sparkly the, quartz. The uh, cabinets in the front here. Yes. And then the big stainless steel farmhouse sink. Yep. So you won't break it if you throw your dishes in. Yep. You've got the gourmet kitchen going on here. Electric five burner with the hood though. I would imagine that will all be stainless yeah, steel eventually. Yeah, they'll close that in or something. Check out the herringbone pattern on the backsplash. That's pretty. And it's got little ripples in it. I really like that color. I have to touch the ripples now. <laughs> it is ripply. It's ripply. You got a reach in pantry here. And then microwave over an oven, right? And then check out this little sunroom. This could be your eating kitchen area. Well, I mean, the or way they have that. the light set up here, yeah, you could do it right here mm -hmm. and then have this be like a smaller sitting room. Yeah. You could do either one. This could be a great reading room. You know how I knew this was supposed to be the reading room and not the kitchen? How? Because this one has the chandelier in here. Oh. And it's got the booby light in here. <laughs> the booby light. <laughs> But look at this, how grand this is looking up. The big windows up top. Oh yeah. You never have to wash those. That's a rule. Man, I want to yodel in this room. All right? This, the echoes in here, I'm going to yodel. Yodeling. <laughs> now hold on, you went to a Iraqi wedding. I did. Didn't they do something different? I did, yeah. It's not a yodel, it's something No, else. I forget what it's called, but it's the that sounds better yeah, than that. I that like was, that. That's a streak of joy. So this is the gas fireplace. Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold up, hold up. It's hold gas. Up. What, we got gas in the neighborhood or not? Yeah. The switch is right there. So what's doing with the... Why is the stove not gas? All right, we're gonna try to figure that out for yeah. you. All right, down here has gotta be a bedroom. It looks like a primary bedroom down. Yes. Definitely, Definitely primary. Windows over there. Tra transient, transom. <laughs> you are. You know what though? I learned, I looked it up after. Okay. We've been calling it wrong the whole time. Oh, seriously? Transom is just the skinny windows that are up high. Okay. These are something else I haven't figured out what they're called. They're windows. We're they're just called windows. Square windows. Square windows. Square high windows. To let light in. Yes. Good lot on this one, right? Look at the sky today. It's very pretty. And then we've got 
two sinks on each side, and I would imagine there'll be glass across this shower. Yeah, with a bench. Like a frameless door shower. This is a good size shower. I like it. You've got a linen closet here. You've got the throne room here. And then a closet with no power. Decent size. I like how they did the tile all the way up, having yes. the bench including the same tile. With the high square windows. And the high square windows. <laughs> Very nice. Let's go upstairs. Okay, I thought I forgot there was an upstairs here. Right? With, with the size of the ceiling, of course there is. All right, I'm going upstairs. Got the wood treads on the stairs. Nice. Lots more green and blue tape here. They're getting ready to finish up and make the paint all party. And another loft. We're good. Good size loft. So oh, there's just, two bays. Just oh yeah. So this one must be two bedrooms up here. Oh, I've seen this model before somewhere. I was in this one. I think over in the other Ridgeville. <sighs> yeah, that sounds familiar. Yeah. So kind of a small closet, but not too bad. Good size room though. <clears throat> it's actually good if you have kids that you need to separate, not have yeah. right next door to each other. You can other. still hear them because it's open up here. Full bath, all right. And another bedroom. And actually a really big bedroom for the for a secondary bedroom. Yeah. This all is right. cool. Let's go back outside. All right, Mark, this is the Davidson. Uh, big house, 3,051 square foot, five bedroom, three bath, two car garage. All right, let's go check this out. This one is almost done. Probably, uh, this is typically what you'd see a house look like when there's about a month left on it. Month, maybe month and a half, yeah. Front porch is good. It's got some nice flooring in it. Which is this? Looks like the laminate flooring. And the good news, some of the smoke detectors <laughs> need new batteries, so we need to get we get to listen to beeping. So this would be a formal dining room, right? Yeah. I like the Wayne Scotting. Yeah, this is pretty. If you're not a formal dining room person, which I'm not, we, we don't. Could be a flex room though. But you could totally be, yeah. Another office space. Look at the crown molding they put in here too. It's, it's like a double crown. Double crown. That's like when you get the checker all the way down to the end of the board and you get and they get the Kings. The, the king, yeah. Yeah. It's the king dining room. It's the king crown. <laughs> wow, they even did um, crown here in the entryway too. I mean, not crown, uh, wainscoting. A little coat closet. Chairs and squares, whatever. Chairs and squares. All right, so if we walk in a house <laughs> and you see blue and green tape, here's, here's the lesson for okay. you today. The green tape is where there are drywall issues. The blue tape is where there's paint issues. Okay. So the guys will come in and fix the green ones first, clean up any drywall problems, and then they'll come back and they'll do the blue tape. I feel like this wall probably should have just had a big, big old, old piece of blue tape across the whole wall. That's a little excessive. But this is good. I mean, uh, they're doing their job. They're doing their job. It's before be, a client even looks at like. it. That's right. Yeah. So before this home even gets bought, they're gonna have this all taken care of. Yeah. So good for them. So more tape over here. Got the nice backsplash. Look uh, at the quartz. I love the quartz. This is pretty. Are they soft clothes? They are not soft clothes. Not soft clothes. So one bowl sink. Electric in this one. Okay. Well, nice backsplash. Yeah, I like that. Just simple, white, clean. Mm-hmm. All right, so this must be like a butler's pantry area. I wonder if they're gonna put something. Oh, big, uh, big pantry here. Big pantry. Costco. And yeah, but we have BJ's this is closer than in Somerville. Yeah. yeah, I would prefer Costco. Would you? Yeah, don't don't tell BJ's that. Okay. I I like Costco a little better. It's just a little far away. It's, yeah. It's I I was a member when I first moved here, but then when BJ's opened, I just started going there. It's so much closer. And this one is available. So if somebody is looking now. Yep. Um. But. So first floor guest room. Okay. Or this could be another office space if you wanted to. It's got closet here and then a door that goes into the bathroom. Okay. Two ways into the bathroom. But it's a full bath here. And the, oh, that's interesting. Another bedroom? No, another bathroom. Another bath? Yeah. Oh, so for your guests. Just a, just a half bath back here. Okay. So if you have somebody in that room, 
and you have guests over, they don't have to use that bathroom. They have this half bath. Very nice. That, that's that's grandpa saying, don't let nobody use my bathroom. That's right. <laughs> Check this out. It's a crawl space? Yeah, well, storage space. Storage space. Yeah, love that. Nice. And uh, it's got a man door. Yeah. That, that's uh, somewhat surprising. We don't see a lot of builders putting man doors in the I garage. I put one in my house. I really you, enjoy it because then I don't it? have to. Oh yeah, all the time. Yeah. Yeah. The hot water heater here in the garage. Yep. <clears throat> I wish I had that extra storage space in my house. Right? Christmas decorations for sure. Should we show them the lot first before we go upstairs? Yeah. So it looks like it's going to have a covered porch. And it's locked. On a pond lot. So a nice little pond. Yeah. Little tiny bit bigger lot than what we see more in the heart of yeah. Somerville. Yeah, this is probably almost 0 0.2 acres, probably. I think so. Right? And it is um, vinyl siding. Yep. Okay. All right. I'm you know it's getting close to completion when they've got fresh pine straw out there. Yes. So what do you think here? Carpet on the stairs, probably? I don't know if they're they putting got the, the carpet wood down treads there. down or not. You would think if they were going to do carpet, they would have already had it done. Yeah, I mean, there was carpet. There's carpet front. up here. I think they're putting wood treads down. Wood there. treads then. Okay. Treads just haven't come in yet. So big loft space. Whoa, yeah. I like the openness of the stairs and the, yep. what do they call them, spindles? Yep. Just makes it, you're right, it makes it feel much more open than having mm -hmm. a wall, a right. half wall around this. So, guest room here, right? All right, so Secondary. guest room there, laundry here where most of the bedrooms in the house are. Is that gonna be a oh, throw through yeah. window? You love them throw through. I guarantee here. that's gonna be the primary there then. Yeah. Laundry room. So let's say the primary for the last. All right. Full bath, two more big bedrooms here. Okay. With walk-in closets. These are big bedrooms. They are. And this is the reaching. That looks, yeah. Okay. And then the primary. Well, all the uh, smoke detectors are like competing with each other. <laughs> me, no me, no me. Oh, look at the size of this. Holy cannoli. You could have a sitting area and a bed in here. Totally. And it's still got the crown in here too. Or you could go two beds in here. Yeah, Jeff and Andrea style. There you go. There you go. Here's what the lot looks like from the upstairs. Very nice. Little leak on that one. That'll be fixed. It'll be fixed. Big tub. I like the lights too. With a nice shower. And a big window out the tub. Ooh. Deep. It's deep. That's a Mark Clem tub right there. <laughs> nice we still have water displacement issues, but <laughs> we'll probably be okay. Not if you only half fill it. Ooh, look at the drain in this shower. Ooh, it's fancy. It is fancified. That's a big closet too. And there's your throw through. Oh yeah. So if you're really good, you can get it right in the... Totally. Yeah. I want to throw something in there so bad, but I don't have anything to throw. Throw your glasses. No, they might break. <laughs> I need those today. So I really like these plans. I do. Hey, you got a haircut. I did. I just realized I'm looking you got else. a haircut. Slim. Look at me. <laughs> Wait a second. I think I lost 20 pounds on my head. <laughs> I could lose 30 pounds with a haircut, but I have to shave my back also. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Don't picture that. You don't want Please to see don't. that. No. Please don't. That'll give you nightmares. I yeah. hope you're not watching this before you go to bed. Let's get back on track. Back in the game. So these, these plans, super nice. I really liked all the trim work that they did. Mm -hmm. The uh, crown molding up top, the chairs and squares or wainscoting, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. The nice finishes in the kitchen the square windows square yeah <laughs> high square windows high square windows that's what we're calling for now until we can find out what they're really called <laughs> but lots lot lots of stuff yeah in, now, in this area here i think it's it's a dorchester two school so yep. it's it's but it's really still close to everything that somerville has to offer so i'm a big fan of the area i love that given state park right down there we've i used to take the girls there a lot when they were young yeah that's a kind of a cool amenity that not many places have right you're not going to have a swimming pool in this community mm -hmm. but you do have some nature trails and some ponds to maybe have some fun fishing in but remember you like can that. always just go out with your neighbors 
and do the Jeff dance. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Somerville, Ridgeville, Jeff dance. So I named that right there. That's going to be a TikTok right there. <laughs> that's a TikTok? Yeah, that's the, my, my daughters do the TikToks, and they're all like doing this and yeah. this, and I, I don't know. I can't. This is the Jeff she, dance. She tried to teach me, but I cannot remember up to the second move. This, I can do this all day. All right. All uh, right. Well, listen, if you want to know more about his dance <laughs> or more about this community, or maybe this isn't the right community for you, we would love to talk to you, but we love to do it on a Zoom call. Yeah. So down in the description, there's a link you can book a Zoom call with us. We'll do emails, texts, and phone calls too. We'd rather get face-to-face -face with you no matter where you are in the country or across the world. Yeah. Uh, and that way it makes it, a little bit better. And if we're on camera, we can do the dance together. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. for sure. Hey, listen, also do us a big favor, like and subscribe to this channel. We're putting videos out all the time. We want you to be able to see them and it does help us out. We appreciate you. We'll see you in the next one. See ya. It's on video. Yes. <laughs>